Srapik. Today, Seva I have uh, published the syllabus for computer science. So here is the syllabus for computer science for class 10, for class 10. And uh, you can see here for first unit test, it is chapter 1, introduction to computer science, uh, introduction to computer network and chapter 4, introduction to loops. For Hafeli, chapter 1, introduction to computer network, chapter 4, introduction to loops, chapter 5, nested loops in C, chapter 6, arrays in C, and chapter 7, functions in C. So this uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 chapters are coming for Hafeli examination and for practical you will need, uh, need loops nested loops, arrays and functions in C from there. From chapter 1 there is no practical and for second unit is you will require HTML, list and uh, chapter 2 only. There only we have three parts, all the three parts you will require and for HSLC examination you will require all the chapters, chapter 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 10. Chapter 9 is not required which is structure I think and a pointer is required for annual examination means uh, HSLC examination and marks distribution is like that uh, introduction to computer network in this chapter 5 marks HTML there are 5 marks list 6 marks frames there are 5 marks and uh, octaded database uh, that means MySQL from their 17 mark and if we say HTML marks as a whole then it will be 16 marks 5 plus 5 plus 6 it is 16 and mysql it is 17 and uh, from loops 5 marks nested loop 4 marks arrays 5 marks functions in c 5 marks pointers 5 marks and the last one introduction to object oriented programming from there 5 marks total 70 and from practical it is 30 marks so only chapter 9 is not necessary for hslc examination so i hope you have understood for Hafeli, many of you have confusion whether pointers chapter will come or not. So, pointers is required for HSLC examination, but at present for Hafeli, you don't require that chapter. So, you will only prepare chapter 1, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Thank you for watching. See you in a new video. Till then, take care and bye.